make a golf team. I'm pretty excited about it. I mean, the ones I'm gonna be playing to first are the elephant ears. I don't know if you can see it because the sun's shining on it. But these are elephant ears. And there are birds everywhere. It is a very nice day, and there's still snow on the ground. There's still quite a bit of snow on the ground. But for some reason, Mother Nature just chose to make it beautiful. It's like it was meant for me to record today. Or plant the bulbs today. Though it says to plant these about um, two to three inches. And yeah, two to three inches. I thought that was wrong at first because these are so big. I thought you'd probably have to plant it deeper. But two to three inches is perfect for this bed. So I added some soil to this to make it just a wee bit deeper. And now I'm just going to wish that nothing blows away. Hope for the best. And here's some big bulbs too. This one's already starting to sprout. And even when it does even when it starts to sprout. It doesn't mean you can plant it right to here. Plant it all the way down. Deep. And I couldn't find my trowel. I don't know where it went. But it doesn't hurt to get your hands dirty. I mean, this is gardening. Have fun. That's all I gotta say. Just have fun with it. I mean, unless you got a $100 manicure. Other than that, I'd say just go for it. We got it planted right here. Just, I don't know what that is. Leave it right there. And just kind of shove it right there. Just hide it down very gently. I got. Well, that was a fail. I bought three um, of these for $2.98. And uh, I'm comfortable. I'm sitting on stones here. Not the best place to sit. But anyways, yeah. What I planted in here before that never sprouted um, was pump or not pumpkin. Um, what I planted in here um, before was... Uh, potatoes. Waiting for the eyes to come upon, to come up, and I put, I cut them up, put them in the dirt, hope for the best, and nothing happened. Just my luck. But that's okay. I don't think it was really the time of year for us. A trowel would really be nice right now, but that's okay. There we go. Okay. Planted one here and I planted one here. Now let's see if I can, I bet I can plant one right here. Ah. Oh, so tough. So tough. Ugh. Put some muscle into it. Get your good workout. Ah, that's good. Especially for this big size. You can just scoop it on in there. Pat it down. all good. That says to, pl to plant it um, April through May. Or not April through May. Uh, March through April. And it's March 7th right now. So 
I played them pretty early, um, but it's still at the good time. Still in March. So now I'm just gonna be trying to plant them in this kind of hard soil. It's not really hard anymore. It's actually pretty soft. My bad. Yeah, that's pretty soft actually. I thought it was really expected to be really tough. I'll take a bulldozer to it to break it up. Let me see if they can donate some dirt here. Make a donation, please. I don't know. I don't know if that's enough. That's probably enough. Let's see how much. Oh, uh, two to three inches as well. Uh, put some muscle into it. I don't know why they plant, keep this with dirt. I guess maybe to keep it moist. And this one's starting to sprout as well. And right, right behind you is my collapsed greenhouse. <laughs> um, I, I'm not gonna be posting the greenhouse video. Um, that was that was the whole process of making. Because right now, it's collapsed. It finally, it was up for about, I don't know, it was up for about a month or so. And, uh, but it finally made its way to collapse. I knew it was a failure after a couple days. Uh, but, I'm going to be taking it all apart and restarting. Um, I'm going to be making it into kind of a trapezoid shape probably a weird looking greenhouse but it's gonna go this way this way this way and this way it's gonna be a trap you, you all know what a trapezoid looks like uh, hopefully you do but yeah. yeah I don't think this is deep enough I'm gonna donate some more dirt uh -oh. oh. Oh, my eye. Ah. I'm half blind. Ah. Okay. That was not good. And the sprouts, they're sprouting over uh, my high axis. Hi can hi cannot hi kayasins hi can oh who cares anyways that's what's sprouting over here finally I feel bad for them because they were already sprouting and uh, it was already sprouting and right when it started to sprout it snowed it snowed a couple feet on them it snowed so bad I couldn't see any of my raised beds and I was out here. And my greenhouse stood up and um, was actually nice and warm in there. And in the morning, I was looking outside um, of my window and I noticed there was this black animal. Um, I don't know if it was a dog or a cat or what, but it walked behind my greenhouse. And I think it made its way in the greenhouse. So, that was a smart animal. I mean, that, that's what I would do. I, if I found a abandoned greenhouse, which wasn't really abandoned, but if I found a greenhouse outside, I would certainly go in it if there was an opening. Be the best way to save your life. Okay. Ah. I might have to plant them over there. I think I will. Yeah. Because there's five in this package. I might plant three here, three here, and two and two over there. 
get the third one. There we go. <laughs> Pretty rough for them. I just went. Oof. That's okay. And just scoop it on in there. Pat it down. Good to go. Let's go with this one. Pushing it off to the side. Let's see if I can get another donation from Dirt. Dirt City. Ah. Good old Dirt. Ah. Another dirt? Another bulb? Oh wait, no. There we go. I'm playing three of different kinds. Or two different kinds, but three bulbs of two different kinds of plants. I may sound a little congested. If you notice my voice is a little different. That's because I'm getting over a cold. Oh my. What the heck? That almost looks like. Uh, I don't know. The biochemical failure. Lizard, bird, duck. I really have no idea. But that looks cool, kinda. Kinda like a rhinoceros. A little horn. Mutant Rhino, what you could call it. Okay, that's sort of kind of two inches. But after I put this on here, it's about two inches or so. I'm gonna have to get more dirt. And that's how you plant bulbs. <laughs> no, not really, really other way I can say it. But that's how you plant calidium, calidiums, and elephant ears. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you for watching.